Welcome back to Medical Toxicology. It's time for our medical toxicology news. Without further ado, let's dive into the latest developments and intriguing cases in the field of toxicology. A two-year-old Palestinian child named Khaled died after eating bread made from animal feed in the northern Gaza Strip on February 27. According to Khaled's grandmother, Ibtissam al Khalut, the older children vomited and recovered, and the younger one, Khalid, deteriorated and ultimately passed away. Khalid was poisoned by bread made from animal feed, which contained fodder and barley. Animal feed is not suitable for human consumption. It can contain various substances that are toxic to humans, such as pesticides, mycotoxins, produced by fungi, or high levels of certain compounds that are safe for animals but not for humans. Ingesting animal feed can lead to various symptoms depending on the toxic substances present. In this case, the older children who ate the bread vomited and recovered, suggesting their bodies could expel the toxic substances. However, Khaled, being younger and more vulnerable, suffered worsening symptoms and ultimately died from the poisoning. Doctors confirmed that Khaled was poisoned by the bread, fodder and barley consumed. Ashraf al Kudra, the Gaza Health Ministry spokesperson, urged international agencies to provide food and drinking water to prevent a humanitarian catastrophe. The UN humanitarian agency, OCHA, reported that humanitarian organizations are being denied access to Gaza and aid convoys are under attack. A senior UN official warned that about one quarter of Gaza's population, at least 576,000 people, is on the brink of famine. Thanks for watching Medical Toxicology. Take care.